Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, hi, my name is Christina and welcome to Tales with Tina. And I'm so glad that you are joining me for another video. So today's video is going to be an October TBR, books that I want to read in October. And I hope that I will be able to read all of these in October. Um, I have a couple of lighthearted ones and then a couple of uh, thriller books. So um, I have four books total and I'm just hoping that I can read them all in October. And so without rambling on anymore, uh, let's just get straight into this video. So the first book is Betrayed by Emily Henry. Um, I have seen this book all over booktube and um, it's basically about two authors that they live in neighboring beach houses and they um, have writer's block and they're complete opposites of each other but they're helping each other out um, and <coughs> it's just, <coughs> you know, a, you don't know, you know, if they're going to fall in love, they're not going to fall in love, but I'm really excited to read this book and just, um, have a lighthearted, um, summer read because sometimes, you know, fall can be a little depressing, but yeah, so this is the first one, Be Treed by Emily Henry. The next book that I am going to mention is The Library of Legends by Janie Chang. And this is set in World War II. And um, it's basically about um, when um, Japanese bombs start falling on China, um, you know, people are trying to flee and evacuate and um, 19 year old Hu Lan and her classmates at the university they go to, um, they have to flee and they have to walk a thousand miles to safety and they have to take a 500 year old collection of myths and folklore, um, with them and it just, um, it's about the journey and um, you know, they, it's just, you know, talking about, you know, what they had to go through to get there and, you know, to be able to get safety. And I'm thinking, you know, since it's myth and folklore, you know, there's going to be a little magic in here, I hope. So I'm really excited about this book and that's what the cover looks like. I think the cover is so pretty. All right, the next two are um, thriller um, books. So the first one is Then She Was Gone by Lisa Jewell. And it's about this girl who just suddenly disappears and um, she basically is trying to figure out why her why and how her daughter disappeared and she meets this guy who um has a daughter that reminds her of her daughter whose name was ellie and um she's um the mom just wants to uncover the clues and you know finally figure out what happened to her daughter and so um you know, it's a thriller, might be a little bit of romance, but I think this is mainly going to be, you know, just a quest, you know, for, you know, her to figure out, you know, what happened to her daughter and if she falls in love or along the way, great. But then she was gone by Lisa Jewell. All right. And then the last one is November 9th by Colleen Hoover. 
I am reading It Ends With Us by Colleen Hoover right now. I'm about halfway through it. And I have just fallen in love with Colleen Hoover books. And so I thought for this month, I would read November 9th. And it's basically about um, a girl named Fallon who she meets um, Ben, who's an aspiring novelist when she moves across the country. And um, she is asking herself, you know, if, you know, Ben is who he really is because they spend a lot of time together, but she really starts to question, you know, um, you know, if he's telling her the truth or if he's just trying to fake it for, you know, to make up a story for his book and, um, you know, she's asking, you know, is he real? Is he true? Um, you know, is this going to end in heartbreak? Is this going to, you know, be a happy relationship? And so I'm really excited to read this. It, I think it's going to be a quick read. That's what a lot of people have said about this book. And so I'm anxious to read it and anxious to see what it's like. Um, I'm really enjoying It Ends With Us by Colleen Hoover. Um, so I think that I'll really enjoy this book by her as well. So those are the four books that I would like to read in October. Um, and I really hope that you know, I like them and that they're good reads and that they're good recommendations for you guys as well. Um, you'll definitely have to stay tuned um, at the end of the month for the what books I read in October video so that way I can give y'all an honest review of these books. And um, so, I'm really excited. I love reading. I've really been loving just being able to get into different stories and kind of just get out of reality for a little bit and, you know, just really enjoy being in a different setting. And so, yeah, that's all I have for y'all. And I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and if you did make sure to hit the thumbs up the subscribe button and the notification button to get notified of all my future videos and i hope that you guys will just hop into a book and you know just enjoy yourselves and have a good time and i hope that you guys have a blessed day and i will see you in my next video all right, bye guys.